So here it is guys, 2022 GSX 1000. And uh, the paint job is pretty cool. It has a pearlescent gray. So I don't know if you guys can see, but it's got those uh, sparkles in the paint, which is pretty cool. The, ZX, the new ZX10, as you guys know, has that as well in the black. So pretty cool seeing a lot of these new bikes have the pearlescent uh, paint schemes. So I'll just give you guys a 360 and then uh, Tebow's going to come out here and explain the difference between this version of the Suzuki versus the R version. So quick 360 for you guys. Beautiful bike. Got her off the dyno, put her back together. Um, there's a couple of uh, questions that some people have. Um, this is your base model GSXR 1000. Um, there's a few differences. Um, it's not major. Um, this bike does utilize Showa BPF forks, which is a big piston forks. Um, basically, the R, a tall tail sign, has a gas chamber on the back. And I'm sure you guys seen it. This is the the base model fork. I actually like this fork better just because it's lighter. But uh, you know that's the big difference of forks. The R and the non R they do have different dashes. Um, and then uh, the R uses a more advanced traction control. It uses a five axis IMU. So you have like a slide control built in, you have wheelie control built in, you have lean angle, throttle control maps that are <clears throat> that are the big differences. Um, as far as the electronics, that's really the big difference. Um, this bike still has traction control, it's just not as advanced. Um, another thing is, chassis wise, the Non-R does not come with adjustable swing arm pivots and adjustable swing arm pivots, you can move your swing arm up and down, forward and back to achieve uh, very specific geometry numbers. You know, like some of us, uh, we like our, our rake and trail really aggressive. And then when we have our rake and trail really aggressive, you know, we have to run like really high, swing arm numbers so what we would do is we would actually drop the swing arm angle with a swing arm pivot and that's why they have swing arm pivots so go ahead and come on this side um, this is a 2022 GSX-R1000 and in the description we'll be talking about this a little more but the base model Gixxer 1000 does come with a quick shifter that is also auto blip so um, I know originally the 17s did not have that, so, you know, the newer ones have a new ECU update and that does have an auto blip and a quick shifter. Sweet. There you, there you guys go. One, one last walk around for you. And there she is, 2022 GSXR 1000.